Okay, join us back on the track. Uh, Rubens Barrichello has just got in the car and he is going to see if he can beat Nigel Maxwell's time on the F1 driver's lap board. Let's see how he goes. My lucky pants. The lucky pants. Can we see your lucky pants? Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. That's the front bit. I've got to take a picture. Andy, that is gross. That is too, that's too much. Andy, can I do that again? The back is, oh I'm afraid, God. the same. Oh I've had them since 1995. Andy. No, you wouldn't see it, Bob. And have they brought you luck since 1995? Well, we've won an Emmy. We were voted yeah. TV show of the decade. Um, we won other things. And um, I used to wear them in the 90s when Jeremy and I were doing our Around the World documentaries. They were to keep aeroplanes in the air. That was their first purpose. And they work them because every flight we've done never crashed. Oh, okay, hang on. Ruben's coming back. Hold on. Smooth. You have to smooth. So they used to keep aeroplanes in the air and they did that very well. And then when we came back with the show, I wore them every Wednesday. And look what we've become because of the other guys think it's because of the script writing their on-screen charisma the ideas that the, everyone comes up with in the office the editing the camera work uh, marketing and um, you know stringent editorial policy I think no I think it's these tatty Calvins which now don't cover any of my under areas whatsoever I'm afraid so that's the Top Gear secrets out in the open. So, do you reckon Barrichello is going to beat the stick? I mean, he's really smooth and stuff. He's fast. I don't know. I can't tell because it's all tense. And you know, when you're up in there, um, rarefied atmosphere, it's tense and tense and tense. There's a few tense splitting Mansell, Jensen, Lewis, Weber. Da -de -da -de -da. You have, have no clue. It's a mistake. So, Stig, Rubens is looking pretty quick out there. Are you getting worried he's going to beat your fastest lap time? Well, it's going very well. It's uh, funny. It's uh, it's a different challenge. I mean, it's not a uh, you know you might think that Formula One you get bored in in just driving um, a small car, but it's it's a good challenge. It's a different one. It's front wheel drive, and uh, for you to get to the apex of the corner is quite a difficult difficult thing. So I enjoy. I enjoy very. And are you looking forward to the British Grand Prix? Very much. I mean, the British Grand Prix is a, is a second home for me, not just for the team, but I enjoy Silverstone very much. I won one of my best races back in 2003 here, so I look very much forward to it. Oh, my God. 